Hey guys, welcome to Civilization 6! <laughs> Finally! Congratulations everyone, we made it. We didn't die before the game released. Congratulations. Woo. <sighs> now, is that song gonna start up again? Because I want that song going. It's gonna start up again. Fantastic. Sonio de Volare by Christopher Tin. Uh, huh. Getting the game started has been a little bit tricky, but uh, let's get things going. Game options first, of course. There's my audio settings. Here's the game settings. Quick combat. I want it disabled. Quick movement disabled. I like watching them. Is there a way to turn it on just for the AI? I'm not sure. Auto end turn disabled. That can get confusing. Tuner disables it. What's tuner? I don't know what this is. Advisor, new to Civilization. New to Civilization 6 is correct. Turns between autosaves. One sounds good. Number of autosaves to keep. 10. Time of day. Automated time of day. Uh, we'll leave it as, as default. Uh, there's my video settings. Uh, just Let's check out the advanced graphical settings. This is a PC channel. We should look at this. I've not changed any of this, so I guess I should just leave it as is. Shadows on, that sounds good. It's just sort of animated leaders. Can we get that to high? I don't know, let's, let's put it on high. These are all high. Ambient occlusion, yep. All right, this is a PC channel. We, we gotta set things up first. Uh, English. There's never English UK, is there? <laughs> well, there's uh, cinematic subtitles. Let's turn those on for your benefit. Clock format, 12 hours, that's good. Start in strategic view. Oh, okay. Lock master window, never, no, it's fine. Uh, scroll when mouse at edge, disabled. Oh, actually, let's lock the mouse and enable scroll when mouse at edge, okay. That sounds like something I want. Key bindings, fantastic, there are key bindings. Application, show intro video, we'll turn that off because uh, we don't want to stream that by accident or anything. Okay, confirm. That's fine. Uh, so it looks like I do have to... Uh, it's fine, we'll just continue. Huh, there is a tutorial! Hmm. <laughs> now, just so you guys know, 543 people are watching right now and I have my coffee, I've eaten a burger, um, I've gone to the restroom, I'm here to play Civilization VI. It's fantastic. Let's have a quick look at multiplayer options here. Internet. There's some uh, games going on. Create game. I want to see what rules there are on multiplayer options. Simultaneous turns, start error, game speed online. Oh, not sure what that means. Map sizes. We got continents, fractals, inland seas, island plates, Pangaea, shuffle. Okay. Uh, there was supposed to be... I haven't watched the multiplayer stream because I've been a bit busy today. No barbarians, no tribal villages. Standard rules? Okay, it seems like uh, the game modes are not in. And uh, just so you guys know who's playing right now, there's a couple games right now. <laughs> Two games are out there, starting up. Uh, single player. Um, create game, come on, don't play now. Okay, choose game difficulty. We're gonna play on King. Choose game speed. I think we'll go on quick because this is a live stream and uh, the more we see the better. Choose map type. Continents is a nice start, right? Choose map size. It defaults to small. Let's go standard. Advanced setup. Okay, um, rule set. Standard rules. Game difficulty king. Ancient era. Quick. Continents. Map size standard. World age standard. We'll keep everything standard. But I'm just showing you what options we have here. Hmm. Start position. Ooh, up to legendary. Standard? Standard's fine. Victory conditions. Culture, domination, religious? There's the new one. Science victory, score victory, advanced options, limit turns by game speed. Okay. And there's a random seed. Okay. We've got... Uh, this is me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So eight players on a standard map. Uh, I am not a random leader though. You guys voted. And I am... Where is it? Peter of Russia. 
Privet to all my Russian viewers out there. That's the limit of, my, of what I know of, of Russian because uh, I play Overwatch and uh, <laughs> Zarya says Privet, so uh, Privet, it means hi. Oh. I'm not disabling any victory then. Some of you asking me to disable score victory, it's fine. We'll leave it there because the game has to end at some point. <laughs> A lot of you know one other Russian phrase. Um, well, let's just start the game. Let's just start the game. Oh no, I misclicked. Misclicked. From the first stirrings of life beneath water. Sean Bean. To the great beasts of the Stone Age. To man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest. From this early cradle of civilization on towards the stars. Embrace the chill winds of the motherland, Tsar Peter. Your fascination with science and culture is a gift, and you will learn much from your grand embassies to foreign lands. Under your rule, Russia will surely flourish and spread, absorbing all that lies around it, perhaps creating the greatest land empire seen on this earth. Ah, oh, Sean Bean. You guys voted on my video. Number one for the stream was Russia. For the offline video series, I'm going to be playing China. So not quite Ni Hao yet. It's going to be Privet for this stream. Oh, I'm, I'm scared to press begin game. <laughs> I've been so invested in... I have not been a, so invested in a game before its release. And not even playing any of it. I have not played any... Civilization 6. Not even a little bit. Not any preview, not review copies, nothing. This is the first time I'm gonna actually have buttons to click on a Civilization 6 screen. Here we go! Ooh! As your personal advisor, I am qualified to assist you in all matters related to ruling our civilization. I am at your service. Fantastic. We're new to Civilization VI. Whew. Here we are. We, we have a game. <laughs> Clicking buttons. Okay, now the mouse is not contained to my window here. Um, can, I, can I do that? I, I'm sure I activated that, right? Interface. Lock mouse to window. Always. Oh. That's one of the changes where I have to restart the game. Okay. So I guess we're gonna have a quick restart here. Can I just quick save this game? Yep. Is that, is that saved? Okay, good. Let's exit to desktop. Let's do a quick restart. The screen's gonna go black. I'm still gonna stay here. But I need that mouse cursor confined, right? That's, that's an important thing. Now let's start up the game again. Don't worry, we're coming straight back. Come on, come on. Let's get this game started. Loading, please wait. Here it comes. Oh, here we... It should be starting up. There we go. There's 2K. Okay, we can't skip the these, these logos. Praxis, thank you for making the game. 2K, thank you for publishing the game. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Uh, where's the single player? Resume game. From the first stirrings of life, we get to water, we get to listen to this again. To the great beasts <laughs> of the Stone Age, to man taking his first upright steps, you have come far. Now begins your greatest quest. From this early cradle of civilization, waiting for the play button towards the stars. I think Embrace the chill winds of the motherland. The mouse cursor should be confined, hopefully. Your fascination with science and culture is a gift, and you will learn much from your grand embassies to foreign lands. There we go. All right, we're back. And the mouse cursor is not confined. It's just, it's just not. How do I, how do I, is it middle mouse to, to scroll around? Okay, I don't want to misclick. Let's, okay, just left click to, to do this. Okay, we're going to have to do this. Ah, welcome to the stream. Now, just so you guys know, 
I have one moderator in chat right now. His name is Sajuk, Sajuk's Let's Plays. You can check him out. He's helping me uh, moderate. He's been a watcher of the channel for a long time. But here we go. We are Russia. This is our settler. We're starting on a river. We've got some copper. Fantastic. We've got some coffee. We've got some sheep. We've got some stone. We've got... This is a fantastic start, isn't it? Like, just from what I understand. We're on a hill and we can see coast. Found city. Is it still B? It's not B. We're just going to press the button. St. Petersburg. Look at all that land. Look how much land Russia just gobbles up. Oh, and there's some music. Oh. I love how the music starts when you build the first city. <sighs> okay, now how do we tell units to move? Is it the same as before? Yeah, okay. So, I guess... Oh, what's that? Silk, nice. Let's head down this way. Choose production. Oh, so I have never actually interacted with the interface, so you're, you're going to have to uh, excuse my, uh, my uh, confusion if I don't know where the buttons are. Okay, we got to choose a first thing. Scout always seems good. We've got our little recommended button there. We'll go for a scout. So despite how much I have uh, researched the game and covered the game, I've never actually played it. Ooh, the tech tree. Is everything the same as what we've seen? I'm not too sure. It's all the way up to future tech there. Nuclear fusion, nanotechnology, robotics. Yep, okay. Ah, what's all this? Units, buildings, wonders. Can I hide the key? Okay, good. So we start with nothing? We'll, uh... What should we go for? We got mining, we've got... Elephants, animal husbandry. Both are good then. Let's go for mining. Actually, no. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Next turn. Okay, cool. Let's, uh, let's just keep scouting. So, unit movements now are a little different. It, you have to have the required movement to actually get onto it. So, what difficulty is this? This is king. There we go. Okay, good. We're going. We're going. <laughs> So, traversing hills is actually quite slow. Oh, this is, uh, these are tundra tiles. Uh, as Russia, we want these. First turns, always a little slow. The map is out of focus. Are you guys seeing this? Okay. Oh, video output is a little low. Um, I'm not sure if the stream is doing okay here. I'm not dropping frames. We'll keep going. See if it gets better. Reconnaissance units like scouts are unique in that they can gain experience by exploring and discovering parts of the world. Oh, fantastic. Now, let me just make sure I look okay. Am I positioned okay? Am I not blocking the map? No, this looks good. I just think I should shift over a little bit. Can I do this? Can I do that? Okay. I should be here. That looks good. Okay. We'll keep scouting here. We've got a tribal hut. And we have a scout. Ah, oh, fantastic. So, I suppose we'll send the scout just straight out this way. Choose a new production. Now, I will, from my research, I know that we should try and balance these things, the science, culture, and faith and gold, right? Culture is important because of the new civics tree. So let's uh, drop down a monument. Get that going. And we're gonna get mining. When you find yourself in a hole, quit digging. Good advice. We got mining. How do I... We get quarries and mines. Okay, good. All right, you. We get our first goodie hut. Mm. 
Turn on production and food icons. Okay, yeah, I haven't explored this. Oh, strategic view. I've been wanting to look at this for a while. Look at this strategic view. It is quite pretty. It's very map-like. I'm not sure of its functionality. We'll, we'll uh, see that over time. Map pins, map options. We can show yield icons. Okay. I think I like it off for now. We've got these lenses. Okay. I know how those work. Let's choose a research. Uh, now, just so you guys know, 650 people are watching, and this is the first time I've had the problem of not being able to, to read all of chat. So if I don't read chat too much, uh, do excuse me. Anyway, we need to get a new tech here. And animal husbandry is going to be good, uh, because we want to get mining, and there's a sheep there. Pottery gives us granary, though. We probably need that first. Unit needs orders. Okay. And again, this is the first time I'm playing the game, so do excuse my, my lack of speed, because I've never actually been able to interact with things. So these are snow. These are tundra tiles, right? Ooh, barbarians. Uh, this is tundra. So Russia gets bonus from these tiles. Okay. Go straight for astronomy for the lavra. That might be good. Ooh, we should try and kill the scout, right? Can we... Can I sort of try and intercept? What is that thing? That's a spearman. 25 base strength plus 6 fortified defense. Plus 10 combat versus anti-cavalry. Okay. But I think I want to try and catch this scout before it scouts the wrong way. So let's try... And Ooh, we are actually at the southern end of the world. Because those are... Does it actually say what these are? Coast ice. Impassable. Okay. Kill scouts first? Yeah, I totally need... No, <laughs> we need to kill scouts. Uh, let's... Ooh, that's gonna be dangerous. They're gonna scout this out pretty quick. So these, these arrows mean zone of control, right? I like these rivers, though. These rivers are gonna be handy. We, we should be expanding up that way, I think. Ooh. Hope you guys like uh, like the stream so far. I'm just uh, I'm just nerding out actually. Can I get that guy? Ah, oh, he's running away. Do you think I can catch him? I don't think my my warrior can can take this camp by himself. Let's try and intercept this guy because if he scouts around, that's gonna be bad. We wanna keep an eye on that. Oh, so we get to the tropics Our already city here. Our city-state neighbors have made a request of us. If we can impress them, I think they will reward us handsomely. Okay, so this actually gives us a nice scale of the world. We go from snow to tropics in about one screen. Can we zoom in and out, actually? We can zoom out. Okay, that's nice. How far can we zoom in? Oh, we can actually zoom in pretty close. Now... I remember the graphics have been a point of contention for a long time. And I think they have actually changed things. I don't think mountains used to look this rugged in the drawn version, right? I don't remember them looking like that. And texture-wise, it does actually look pretty textured. Okay. So we have... New city-state quests. How do I look at... I met a new city-state. Where do I see city-states? Oh, I see why you want to disable edge scrolling. Okay, we've got Vilnius. We don't have any envoys or envoys. So um, someone else met them first. So I see why edge scrolling is an issue. We'll disable it. Confirm. Okay. Because so much of the interface is on the edge of the screen. <sighs> we're gonna, we're just gonna take things slow. We, we gotta learn this stuff. Enacting new policies in our government can be of great benefit. Our people await your decree. Awesome. At also, his best, ah, code of man is the noblest of all animals. Separated from law and justice, he is the worst. 
let's have a look at our policies. In case any of you are wondering what time I'm streaming, the clock is up there. Uh, there we go. Why is it Australian Western Standard Time? Oh, I guess that is my... Okay, it's GMT plus 8. Ah, let's see. We, we are surrounded by barbarians. We're going to take that. Okay. Economic policies, production, faith in gold. We could get... Some faith in gold going, or we could just go for production. Let's go for production. That's fine. That's good. Ooh. All of this is... It, it feels very strange to me. I'm not sure if, if you'll, you'll sort of understand. Because I'm so familiar with Civilization VI. But... At the same time, I'm so unfamiliar because I've never played it before. Now, actually, they do have a quest. Send a trade route. Okay. It's, it's such a strange feeling, right? Because... The Pantanal is the most complex intertropical alluvial plain of the planet. And perhaps the least known area of the world. Yeah, so it, it feels so new and so old. Anyway, the... Pantanata, intertropical alluvial plain of the planet. Okay. Discovering a natural wonder has inspired your people with the uh -huh. astrology. Ah, fantastic. And we got a goodie hut there. Choose civic. Right. Um, what does this give us? Production towards builders, ancient and classical. Uh, we should probably go. Joint war, okay. We should probably go craftsmanship because we're gonna need some units soon for those barbarians. I have a feeling that one, where was it? There it is. Uh, that one might scout us out pretty soon. Do I have early access? No, I do not have early access. It just, ah, damn it, he's seen us. No man ever we need went units. Clay and then left it as if there would be bricks by chance and fortune. Very good. So, this barbarian camp has scouted us, and we have no units to kill the scout, so... Can I actually kill this? Do you think I'll win? This warrior versus this spearman? Let's find out. Like, can we actually overall win this battle? I think we can. 21 damage, 41 damage. Very good. We'll grab that. 40 gold, very nice. And we get to scout out edge here. Ooh, we should definitely settle up there. Uh, the tundra is going to be useful, I think. Are these tundra tiles? That's grassland. Is this... Oh, that's out of our sight. Okay. That's fine. <sighs> what should we get? We need to start bronze working. We get iron as a resource. Irrigation. Kill three barbarians. We might be going that way. Astrology. Shrine and the... The Lavra, right? Our unique district. We should totally go for that, right? Does it? Um, we got so many mountains. We should totally go faith a little bit. Okay. And we need to choose production. We have been scouted, so we are not... Uh, we're going to be a bit smart about this. Um, what is better? Warrior or Slinger? I don't know. Did... Depends what they attack with. I guess warrior. It's just more useful. Generally. We'll get a warrior. Okay. <laughs> I honestly, I don't know what I'm doing. Felipe, rey de España y Portugal. Empero, por encima de todo, somos fieles devotos de la única y verdadera religión. We've met someone. I am the King of Spain, Portugal, Sardinia, and Sicily, Naples, Duke of Milan, etc. But most importantly, I am a devout follower of the one true religion, which I have not yet founded because uh, <laughs> we're in the ancient era. I hope for your sake you are as well. It's an honor to meet you. Would you like to hear of my capital? Madrid is the most beautiful of cities. Is your, uh, is your capital as beautiful as well? Uh, we've got a monument, but that's about it. Exchanging information of our cat capitals. Yeah, let's go ahead. Meeting another civilization. Boosted writing. The barbarians running into my lands. Where are they? 
they're up there. So they met Vilnius first. Okay. That's them. Okay. Unit needs orders. <clears throat> ah. I guess we should just finish up scouting down here a little bit. Because I have a feeling we're going to settle a city somewhere up here. Can we major victory? Let's take this barbarian camp. Do we get it this turn? No, next turn. Decisive victory next turn. Okay, they are taking more damage. How is the stream looking, by the way? 660 people watching. It's it's nervous. It's it's scary. <laughs> Let's take this. Kill him. Okay, good. We'll wipe this out. Progress towards military tradition, tradition has been boosted. Barbarian outpost. Okay. There's that scout. That's the scout from this camp. So we don't have to worry too much about that. Okay. Okay. Let's go to the next turn. Oh, so the, the paths you set the turn before, they do just follow through. Okay. So, looking at this, I definitely want to settle, like, here. Grab those whales, horses, maybe a coastal city? Or I could go on this side for the river city. I have a feeling. I, I like a coastal city, like, right there, I think. You know, that silk, horses, fish, crabs, the natural wonder, bananas up top. That seems really nice. Just out of range of the coffee, though. But I think it'll be good. And uh, with our bonus land, it's going to be fantastic. We'll just grab it all in one go. So we have a place to go for a settler. What is this stuff? New city-state quest, Zanzibar. Uh, how have I met Zanzibar? Oh, they came and saw me. Okay, very nice. We've got a warrior. We've got to start. We should send it out this way. Choose production. Oh, no, we're gonna... I'd like this guy to heal up, but I'll get him onto a hill first or something. I'm gonna scout here, see if we can find a nice spot for a tundra city. And you, just uh, finish scouting up that coast. Ooh, good idea. Good idea I did that. We're going to grab that next and choose production. Okay. Granary, scout, warrior, slinger, settler, builder. Uh, reduce the city population by one when completed. But settlers don't stop city growth. How is our city doing, actually? Six housing, six turns until growth. Okay. We should get a builder, right? We got stuff to improve. Okay. How's our culture? Culture's okay. I'm gonna get a settler first. I don't wanna... I know I should build... I should be a bit... I should be playing a bit wide because... Uh, uh, because I am Russia, but... I want to make sure I control this barbarian camp before I, uh... I go do things. I, I go expand. Alright, let's go next turn. And we've got... What was that? 20 faith? You gave 20 faith? How much faith does it take until you get, like, we stuff? We have recently gained advanced knowledge in city planning. Creating districts in our cities can be much more powerful and lucrative than simple improvements like farms and mines. Good idea. I don't Good. believe in astrology. I'm a Sagittarius and we're skeptical. Arthur C. Clarke. So we just got astrology. Now, I've been going for quite a while now. I need to take a quick break. So I'm going to take a break and uh, I'll be right back. Okay? I'll be right back. Hope you're enjoying the stream. Uh, yeah, we, we've just gotten started. We've just been through the first 15 turns. And uh, yeah, stick around. I'm going to take a quick break. Okay. Uh, 
Yeah, be right back. I'm just so excited to keep playing. <laughs> I don't know how long today's stream is going to go. I'm just going to keep going until I can't play anymore. Sounds fair? Sounds fair. All right, I will be right back.